Oh yeah, everyone. Look, it's Dylan, Walnut Ridge Family RV Sales. Check it out. Look what I got. I've got the brand new Montana High Country 381 TB. This is a two bedroom fifth wheel. Like an actual two bedroom fifth wheel with a loft too. This thing is awesome. Look at the colors on it. Weighing in at like 14.4, so 14,400 pounds dry. And then it is 43.4 feet long. This is a big one. But let's get down to it because this thing is awesome and I'm so excited to show you. So let me flip this video around. All right. If you've been looking for a two bedroom fifth wheel, this is it. This thing is sweet. Montana high country. So you have your six point auto leveling system, road armor, pivoting head box up front, a little bit of high density foam on the inside to help with the chucking up and down as you're driving down the road in different terrains. In here is your inverter, your charge controller, your solar controller, uh, on off buttons, plus your two lithium ion batteries, as well as a battery disconnect. You also have a little bit of storage over here, power cord, all the goodies up in there. Here is the spot for your, your auto leveling system, and then your LP tanks on each side, 30 pounders. Big, huge, large basement, look at that. Huge, man, you can fit like a whole nother bed in there. And then your wet bath, wet bay right there, not bath, wet bay. Um, these do come with the the 12 gallon hot water. It's gas and electric hot water heater. Super cool. Um, they went a little bit bigger, a little bit bigger capacity on there. Man, this thing is awesome. I love the cobalt blue that kind of blends in with the black and the white on the outside. Other pass through storage right through there. You do have outlet, 110 outlets on the outside right here. Gonna hook up a little TV or anything like that uh, on the outside. You can. Solid step entryway, folds up into the coach. Two big awnings, one there, one there, one over your main entryway, one over your slide. Take a look at the back side here. Here's where the fun part is. So two windows on the outside. That's where your loft's gonna be. This is your second bedroom, which we'll get to on the inside. And then back here, boom, second entryway. Yep, fully walkable roof still. You still have your right there, backup camera prepped. It's coming pretty standard across the board nowadays. But we'll get to the inside, show you what the, uh, the second door looks like. And let's go ahead and take a peek because that's where, that's where we need to go. So let's step on in. As a reminder, before we step in, 381TB, 200 watt solar panel up top. This is the strut assist solid step entryway. So a little lighter weight. It's on a strut, so you don't hurt yourself whenever you are um, coming up into the coach. Let's head up into the main bedroom first, and then we'll take a look at the rest of the coach. King bed slide, windows on each side, both of those open so you can get that cross breeze effect. You do have outlets, plus little spots for your CPAP machine. Big wardrobe here, love it. Lots of space in there. And those are, you know, sliding uh, glass windows, or you can use them as like a mirror. So whenever you're getting dressed or anything, you can see what you look like. Washer and dryer prep, or you can use it for more storage. You have your nighttime shades here, being as it is a high country. So roller shades, nighttime only. And then TV hook up here, as well as a dresser inside. Second AC system is controlled right here, which is in this up front unit right here. So you can control uh, the temperature in here rather than the whole coach itself. So pretty cool. And then as you head to the bathroom here, walk-in shower, tri-slide series of the, of the glass doors. You have a vanity sink, tons of storage. And then a little bit of more storage back here next to your toilet. And then it is a porcelain toilet, foot flush toilet. So, Pretty standard across the board, but again, no special cleaning supplies or anything like that. Man, look at this beautiful kitchen, entertainment area, right? You do have your residential refrigerator there. You also have, ah, you could use it as like a coffee bar area or just more storage. Outlets on each side, tons of drawers, tons of storage up in here. These things, I mean, my goodness, look at all that goes all the way up almost to the ceiling so you're going to get a lot of storage in here as well as your drawers and everything down through here there's your tie downs for your chairs go ahead and flip the video around here 
All right. And your main slide, on uh, this is on your campsite. So, table and chairs there, Vent, you know, windows all the way around. All of them will open at least a little bit, so that way you can get the the good camping feeling, cross breeze effect here. You do have the Thomas Paine uh, collector's edition, uh, collection edition of the recliners. And then we'll get to the second bedroom here. Fireplace, TV, JBL sound system, all hooked up. Have the newer three burner stovetop Furion uh, oven and stovetop there. Um, it is a 30 inch oven and then as well as a uh, really large size uh, microwave here. And then like I said, you do have your residential refrigerator. It does have an ice maker on there too. And a lot of people have been talking about that here lately. On the countertop, you do have an extension on the island right here. Really like that for more prepping space. This thing has a ton of prepping space in here, as well as more drawers, more storage all throughout this coach. Even more storage over here. Let's start right here first. Let's go to the loft area. So have a little ladder area here so that way you can get your kiddos to climb up in. It does have a capacity of 250 pounds. I am not that weight, so I'm going to get up in here and kind of give you the full tour. A couple windows up in here, they do open. Both sides do. You also have an AC system up here, as well as it's ducted through here too. And then you have a little TV mount, plus USB hookups right across. Man, tons of room up there, so I think that's pretty cool. Now, let's get to the good stuff. Take a look in here. So, you do step down, and then if you're tall like me, you kind of want to watch your head because that's going to hurt if you were to smack your head. But that's because of the loft, so they had to be able to do something here. So they did allow you to step down, but I would definitely watch your head as you're coming down in here because that could hurt. Queen bed in here. You still have spots for cell phone CPAP machines and 110 outlets on each side. And then as we rotate around, you do get quite a bit of storage in here too. You have hanging clothes on each side over here, a little bit of a rod on both sides, as well as a little dresser, a window, and then a spot to hook up your TV. Now, here's your back door. Leads directly into the second bathroom. This isn't a half bath, this is a full bath. Not only that, look at the ceiling height on this thing. Yeah, that's the full amount of the coach. So even that loft that's up there doesn't take effect into your bathroom, still get your porcelain toilet, still have tons of storage over through here, and then a good size walk-in shower too. That is super awesome, and it is big, huge, huge shower here. Tall ceilings, and then boom, easy way to access and get out of here, so that way you can walk straight out back and not have to worry about walking through the whole coach just to get to the bathroom. So I really like that feature and plus privacy of the second second bedroom and all that. Love the colors in here. Montana is always on top of their game. Keep in mind, it is built for full-time, so it is warranted for full-time living. So you could live in this, 12 volt heated tank pads, um, extra insulation in your slide boxes, as well as a fully walkable roof and this one comes standard with a double AC system. I will attach the link down below, guys. Take a look at it. Let me know if you have any questions. I really appreciate your guys' feedback, too. Um, keep watching. Hit that subscribe button. We got more units coming on here. We got more new ones coming out. Shoot me a text if you have any questions or shoot me an email. Appreciate you guys. See you later. Bye.